something I would tell these little kids is to just put in the extra work. Any, any chance you can, get out there and practice. You gotta practice. You gotta put that extra hard work in to, to get better. It's not gonna come overnight. So you gotta be the one who shows up early to practice or stays late. Well, I think that, you know, the bit of advice to give those kids is, you know, are you working hard or nobody's watching? You know, a lot of kids work hard when they're at practice and stuff. And really learn the, the X's and O's and really learn where your hand should be on the stick. If you have good stick skills, you're gonna be a player. Just small things to make that stick become more a part of you. Spend time with your stick and your friends and family and having fun and enjoying. You better have fun while you're playing a sport. Just enjoy yourself and have fun. You have to have fun. You have to enjoy yourself. I laugh and I play and I might be serious sometimes, but I really, I have fun when I play. I think the number one thing I always did when I was growing up was make sure I had fun. Lacrosse was, was, was a blast to me. I use the word passion, uh, the love of of something that you do. To me, it's it's passion is everything, and then always trying your best. And, and those are the two things that you, you cannot steer you wrong. Have that, that passion for the sport, and they want to continue to get better, and they become the best players in the world because of that uh, that passion. The great players, I think, aren't, they, aren't necessarily the, the most talented, but they're the hardest working ones, and they're the ones that are able to get it done when the pressure pressure matters. You just need to have the work ethic and the mind and the determination to get, get to that point. You got to work. It's all about work ethic. You have to take the per personal responsibility for your conditioning, for how you practice. The first thing I tell kids um, all the time, which I think kind of gets lost, especially nowadays, is to play different sports. Play other sports. I would say play as many sports as you can. I played three sports in high school. And then finally, I always say play other sports. You know, build your athleticism. Continue to, to play as much as you can and enjoy it. Obviously, I think, you know, schoolwork. The ability to balance the school and the, and the lacrosse, um, those are obviously got to be the two top priorities in your life if you want to make it. As long as you have, you're committed to something, whether it's a team or your family or your job, um, see it through and, and to love it and have passion when you're doing it because that's really